with a top speed of up to 407 km per hour. The US rocket AH-56 Chan is considered the fastest combat helicopter in the world, surpassing even the AH-64 Apache or MI-24. The AH-56 Chan was born at the request of the US military that needed a high-speed combat helicopter to maneuver quickly on the battlefield. This project was started in the 1960s, with the winner being Lockheed. The AH-56 Chan is a perfect combination of light helicopter and attack aircraft. It was arguably the world's most advanced attack helicopter in its heyday, with the revolutionary features far beyond its time. Unfortunately, the Shen program never fully succeeded due to technical issues, program management shortfalls, changing procurement priorities, high cost, and a crash in 1969 that left a test pilot dead. Despite never entering service, the Shen left a profound impact on the concept of close air support and attack helicopter design, and today holds a special place in military aviation history. The AH-56A was also called the Advanced Aerial Fire Support System. During the period when the United States was building up its troop strength in Vienna, the AH-56 became a bold attempt to compete with the efforts for a key role in air-to-ground support. The Shen was a highly sophisticated compound rotor craft incorporating design features pioneered in Lockheed's earlier XH-51A test ship. It was a long, slim helicopter with retractable landing gear, small wings that spanned almost 27 feet, and a General Electric T-64 GE-16 shaft turbine engine with a four-bladed rotor. The power rating of the engine was increased to 3,922 horsepower as the test program evolved. The Shen used an innovative propulsion system built around the T-64. The power plant drove a rigid, four-bladed, zero-stabilized main rotor. The tail-mounted anti-torque rotor and the pusher propeller at the extreme end of the tail boom. The Army was looking for a truly giant leap with the AH-56. The service established exceedingly ambitious goals. It said it wanted an aircraft with a top speed of 220 knots able to hover out of ground effect at 6,000 feet with a fair range of 2,100 nautical miles. A little notice feature of the Shen was its ability to self-deploy over long distances, including the 2,200 miles flight from California to Hawaii. Although Lockheed had little experience building helicopters, the Army chose its design in 1966. The crew of two, pilot and gunner, sat in tandem in an enclosed cockpit. The impressive armament of the Shan included a 30mm XM140 cannon in a barely turret and a 40mm XM129 grenade launcher or a 7.62mm minigun in a nose turret. Under the wing were six hard points for ordnance, consisting of huge tow anti-tank missiles or a 2.75-inch floating fin aircraft rockets.
the AH-56 had an advanced weapon sighting system that included night vision equipment and a helmet gun sight. The Army was enthusiastic enough that in January 1968, it placed an initial production order for 375 aircraft. As it turned out, early tensions were built. But in tests, the AH-56 had difficulty maintaining stability close to ground and at high speed. Various design changes seemed to help, but no certain fix had been found when the third chain build was lost in a crash on March 12, 1969. Following the routing of the AH-56, tests resumed in July 1969. By then, the Army had abandoned its production order prematurely, many observers said. The Shen program had also suffered from cost increases. Meanwhile, the Army was getting good results with a less advanced, less ambitious helicopter, the AH-1G Huey Cobra which went into combat in South Vietnam in October 1967. Had its technical difficulties been overcome and had politics not intervened, the Shen could have been a formidable weapon. In some ways, it was more advanced than today's AH-6040 Longbow Apache, which offers some of the capabilities the Cheyenne had, but is not as effective at high altitude. The Cheyenne was an incredible aircraft, said Richard Birch, who piloted the AH-56A at the Juma Proving Ground in Arizona. It would have changed military aviation. <laughs>